Hello everyone, this is me, Sakya here, and I'm back with another bonus love for you, which is going to be for whoever needs it. If you are dealing with a person for quite some time and you really want to know if this person will ever end up marrying you or not, this reading will definitely help you know that. I will be adding some other cards as well, so stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you. It is a general read. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. Will this person ever end up marrying you? Yes or no? Temperance. The Fool. King of Pentacles. Page of Wands. And in the deck, we do have the Emperor. Who dealing with somebody who is very much occupied with so much going on in their personal life. I really feel like you know this person is not somebody who's ready to commit or give into a connection anytime soon. Um, trust me, this person has so much of emotional attachment towards you that they would try to run away from. So this person is going to act kind of weird. This person is going to behave weird in this connection. And you would always have the feeling as if like, you know, they are not even interested in you. You know, they they are somebody who are aware of the fact that you're not going anywhere, to be very honest. And probably it's because you have given them so much power over your, you know, connection. Or this person really believes that you love them so much. So you are dealing with someone who knows that you're not going anywhere. They have a very very much like a faith around it. So maybe it's you who have given them such power that you know, yes, you love them so much, you cannot go away from them, this and that. It can be because of that, or it can also be because of the fact that um, they know you so well. So I feel like, you know, this person has, you know, the tendency to take you for granted. And I feel like, you know, maybe you have treated them so well that they feel like, you know, you, you have kind of like, you know, overwhelmed with them you have overwhelmed them like you know with with the love that you have given to them and they they are like you know aware of the fact that you can never stop loving them so it's more like you know they have a complete faith that you're not going anywhere and at times i feel like you know they take you for granted too now i feel like you know for majority of you this person is somebody who's going to be like always making you back for more because they will be giving you very less to be very honest and they are somebody who's occupied with so much happening in their personal life as well and somehow this person is also very um aloof somebody who wants to have their own kind of life so if we talk about this connection you will always have issues with them because this person will be triggering your emotions in a negative way many a times and i feel like you know, you're gonna feel like probably you know this person is the worst thing that could ever happen to you at many times of your life i feel like you know this person is very controlling and um there are many you know they're, they're manipulative as well um but having said that i really see the chance of this person marrying you are very strong and very high why because this person will never find somebody like you again and they are aware of that they are somebody who is so fucking aware of the fact that nobody is ever going to love them the way you do which is the reason why they're taking you for granted um at the same time I really feel like, you know, this person is somebody who knows your worth in terms of, um, you know, if they ever had a doubt that you could move on from them, they would be a very different kind of a person. Trust me, this person is so, so, so 100% sure that you're not going anywhere, uh, which is the reason why they are not like, you know, valuing you the way they should be valuing you. Um, the moment they have that fear of losing you, they will commit to you. They will give you what, what you want. Um, they know that you're worthy of so much more than they are giving to you right now. And they're still not letting you know that. They keep themselves busy, invested in things that probably have nothing to do with you. Probably has to do with their work, finances, and career path. Um, at the same time, this person is somebody who's uh, kind of like, you know, he doesn't, or he or she doesn't prefer to be with a lot of people. So this person is very much like aloof kind of a person, person who likes to be alone and, you know, spend some time with themselves whenever they have time or, or they choose to, you know, choose whether they want to give, share their time with you or not. So even if they have nothing to do, they would choose if they want to choose to give you some time with them or not. So they are the one who's going to allow the dates or they are the one who's going to allow the time to talk to each other. So they are very controlling that way. 
but that's how they are. But if you ask me, will they marry you? They would love to marry you. They would want to marry you, but on their terms and conditions, they're very controlling. And I feel like, you know, this person is very, um, wow we do have the emperor and the empress i feel like you know this person is very controlling and they will always be controlling this connection is very strong but the the weak part of the connection is that this person is very controlling for some of you probably you enjoy giving so much control to this person for others of you yes you are going to be struggling a lot with how this person treats you before they give into the connection but yes for majority of you the moment you take the power back in your hands and start playing something us with some with them um, with their emotions a bit there will be something which is going to change in this connection i feel like you know your person is um you know they got to have the taste of their medicine before they give you the commitment that you desire for for majority of you when it comes to the current energy it's something that you will have to be very patient with things will change things are going to change but very slowly so you will have to be very patient to get what you want but this connection is definitely very strong you will have the justice served to you but it is going to be a very slow process i feel like you, know, you will be probably feeling like ah, i don't know how long do i have to wait maybe you have been you know with this person for quite some time but i really feel like you know things are going to change um in this connection this person would be giving into the connection um, and not would be marrying you but yes you know th this person is somebody who's going to give you signs and messages with their acts and behavior patterns and i feel like you know even if you want to break up with this person and you tell this person like okay fine if you're not giving me the commitment then i'm going away this person will not stop you but they're going to say something which is going to stop you so this person is always very manipulative with how they handle and tackle the situation and you always give into the connection exactly the way they desire so I feel like you know you will be having some sort of struggles getting what you want with this person but i do see this connection going next level um you know this person ending up marrying you because they can never find somebody like you again and they are aware of it so they would never 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 ever is you know gonna let you go so let's see what else is coming in for you in this read let's see will they ever give you the commitment that you desire will they marry you yes or no I feel like, you know, for majority of you, there will be a lot changing in this connection. For those of you who are chasing after this, you know, this desire of yours of getting married to this person, I really feel like, you know, you got to slow down. Have patience, have, uh, you know, some sort of rest. Try to rejuvenate, try to become confident, try to work on yourself a little bit. Because I really see that there is a desire that you have, but the way to that desire is not easy. You have to kind of like, you know, look within to figure out some changes that you have to make from within to get what you want so for some of you probably you will have to manifest it by working on yourself a little bit and get things through um so yeah that's uh, pretty much it um and yeah till i do the next read for you guys take care and uh, bye